across the UK for us? I mean, I suppose, Lara, the all-important question this morning is, is this the worst of it or, or is the worst to come? Well, it's absolute chaos out there and the rest of the week is looking wintry. But having said that, it's the next 24 hours that are seeing the real troublesome weather. Now, as it clears from the southeast, it is going to be moving further northward. So tomorrow, Scotland and Ireland, the worst affected areas. But the really important thing to remember is just because the snow has stopped, the problems haven't gone away. There's going to be black ice tomorrow morning, some really, really hazardous driving conditions out there. I'll have a full forecast at the end of the programme. We'll though, look forward to that. Lara, thanks very much <laughs> Thank indeed. You. Well, the main thing I want to say to you is if you haven't been out yet today, don't underestimate how bad it is out there. There is some dry weather out to the west, but elsewhere, a lot of snow. Now, the heaviest of it, starting off the day for the southeast and for London, four to six inches in places. Throughout this afternoon, snow flurries carrying on for many. In fact, for most of the east, moving into central parts. But the heaviest of the snow is gradually swirling around, moving into the north by first thing tomorrow morning, affecting Scotland and Ireland. Elsewhere, some very hazardous conditions from where the snow has been, but the heaviest of tomorrow's snow for Scotland and for Ireland.